Hey, what's up guys? iPod Touch Helping here and I've got a good video for you guys and today I'm going to be showing you some of my favorite um, iOS 5 tweaks for your iPhone and iPod Touch. Now these are only going to be the first five favorites that I have and I will have a couple more episodes of videos just like this so you guys should like this video. Um, if you guys want to learn more about each individual tweak that I show, you guys can click uh, the videos and the link in the video description down below, but let's get right on into this. So the first tweak I'm going to be showing you guys that is one of my favorites is going to be BB settings. Now BB settings is the thing right here and basically it allows you to change different things. It's very similar to SB settings, but it has a couple more options. So here we have some of my favorite apps and you can customize these however you'd like. So I can change the these to something else if I want it to, like I could put Instagram here or whatever I wanted. As we move along, uh, we get a couple more options. These ones are, are running applications, so um, the same apps that uh, you have in, when you double click here, that's going to be your running applications up here. Um, if we move farther to the right here, we have our memory usage. And then we also have a bunch of cool options here, which B or which SB settings has. So we can go in airplane mode, Wi-Fi, turn it on and off. You can respring your iDevice if you want, and turn 3G on. Blah blah blah. All that cool stuff that you guys can normally do. And here we have uh, brightness and volume. So that's that. So that would be BB settings. And um, the next tweak I'm going to be showing you guys is called Any Lock App, all one word, available in Stadia. And basically, you can pick any application to be in the bottom right hand corner instead of the camera application. I like it because I do use Twitter quite often and I don't use my camera that much on my iPod. So if you guys ever want to change this, you just go download it in Stadia, Any Lock App, and you can choose which application you want to open just by clicking one of these. So the next application I'm going to be showing you guys is called Now Playing. And what this is, is basically I can play a song and once it starts playing, it'll show you what song's playing on the very top. So here's an example right here. If I just play a song like this, click next. As you guys can tell, we've got a song playing up there. Uh, it just shows the song, very easy tweak. But um, I did like it, thought it was worth getting, and uh, that's one of my favorite tweaks for iOS 5 right there. Now the next one I'm going to show you guys is called Color Keyboard. Now this one, in my opinion, is a must-have. Basically, you can customize your keyboard however you'd like, and I think it's definitely worth going and checking out in Cydia. Color Keyboard, um, you have a lot of different options to choose from. As we open up settings here, we can go to... Um, where is it here? We can just go to color keyboard and here we can make sure it's enabled and we can select a bunch of different themes. And um, you can download more themes in Cydia, I th but it's definitely a must have on iOS 5. Now the next tweak I'm going to be showing you guys is going to be color, or sorry, it's going to be barrel. Alright, so barrel I'm sure a lot of you have heard of. Basically it allows you to do some cool different ways of scrolling on your iDevice. So I'll show you guys another one that I liked. If we just click on barrel right here, click the mode, and uh, we'll do curl and roll away. That one's a really cool effect. There we go. Nice page scrolling for your iDevice. So that's pretty much it, guys, for this video. This was iPod Touch Helping. Expect more videos like this in the future. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.